Hey, what's up, YouTube, and welcome back to the channel. As far as we receive a new jailbreak, and I'm talking here about the Uncover and the Chimera jailbreak, starting from iOS 11 up to 12.2. So let's go ahead and talk about some tweaks for that new jailbreak. Before I'm going to be start today's video, let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up. Also, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, so you will be notified always whenever I release a tweaks video. Okay, so the first tweak that I have for you guys, the dark sounds. What the tweak will be provide you with will be make or bring the dark mode into your music application. So if you want to see right now how it looks like after you set the tweak in your iDevice, this is how it's going to be looks like. So I'm a fan of a dark mode. I like always to bring some dark mode into my iDevice and this is how it's going to be looks like after you set the tweak in your iDevice. You can take a look right now and it's really beautiful. Also, if I want to go ahead right now and jump under the settings, the first thing go ahead and enable the tweak and also you can apply the Nactis if you already set Nactis on your iDevice and also if you want to enable the dark keyboard and also we have some other stuff like for example the color options here so you can go to the theme we have a lot of different kind of style theme you can pick your favor from in there and also if you want to customize and put some colors it is available so by going to the custom color options you can do a lot of different things from in there once you're done go ahead resupring your device so your device will be take the effect and this is the way about the dark sounds once you install a tweak in your iDevice highly recommend you guys to give it a try it is really beautiful and nice looking tweak in your iDevice if you're looking for that kind of stuff the tweak called dark sounds the next one I will be talking about the charge animation this is a really beautiful tweak so once you download the tweak that tweak will be provide you with some nice and beautiful animation once you want to plug your device on a charge if you guys want to take a look how is it looks like or how is it the theme or the animation style that you want to pick from the under the settings this is how it's going to be looks like so by going to the settings go ahead first of all and enable the tweak and then you can tap on the animation stuff or uh, the options that you have so you can pick any one of these uh, options here so you can as you guys can see we have a different kind of style and then also we have a uh, X edge and non X uh, devices edge uh, if you want to use that also we have the watch OS and also we have the iOS style this is what pretty much that tweak will be provide you with once you want to plug your device on a charge this is what the tweak will be provide you with as I told you if you're looking for that kind of stuff go ahead and download the charge animations the next one I will be talking about Alphen. So once you download that week, that week will be provide you with some beautiful and nice looking media player. It will be work on your lock screen and home screen. So if you want to take a look at it right now, just go ahead and just slide it from the side here. And then once you top on it, it will be closed by itself. If you slide it again, top on it, it will be closed by itself. And then also you can control everything from that media. Once you download the tweak, that tweak doesn't have anything to configure under the settings. Once you download it, it will be work right away on your, as I told you guys, lock screen, home screen. Really beautiful. If you're looking for that kind of stuff, the tweak called Elfin. Let me right now jump to talking about the next one, static zoom. So always once you want to use your camera application, once you want to zoom in, zoom out, always you use your both fingers. With that week, can I set for you a slider in the bottom? You can take a look at it right now. So using that slider is going to be make it so simple and easy for you to zoom in and zoom out. You can take a look at it right now, how easy that is right now once you use that tweak or set that tweak on your iDevice. It is really beautiful and nice and so simple and easy and then it's gonna be make your life easier. So once you download the tweak, that tweak doesn't have anything to configure from under the settings. It will be work right away once you install the tweak in your iDevice. 
if you're looking for that kind of stuff that we call static zoom let me go ahead right now and talking about the next one Reedia. so once you download the tweak it will be completely make your Cedia homepage different you can take a look at it right now most of the things on the Cedia homepage it looks different it wasn't like the normal stock of Cedia so once you download the tweak the tweak doesn't have anything to configure once you download it in your iDevice it will be uh, make everything different on your Cedia homepage so yeah guys as I show you if you're looking to change the homepage of your Cedia application it is available as I told you guys and as I show you guys you can go ahead and download the re Cedia so anyway guys this is the most tweak that i want to share with you guys in today's video so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video don't forget give the video a huge thumbs up and also make a short subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a new video catch you with the next one peace